Okay, so this is a pretty typical posture that you see with someone who's working from home or, or schooling from home now in these times. And it's just not ideal. If you notice, her head is forward, she's reaching with her shoulders, and her hips are forward. So I want to illustrate to you, Kendra, how much more strength you need when you sit in this posture versus a good posture. So let me have you sit up nice and tall. So sitting up nice and tall, and I'm gonna have her hold that right arm out for me. So I'm gonna manual muscle test this shoulder right here. And I've got her shoulder blade into her rib cage, and she's gonna hold the hand right there. So hold that right there, don't let me push it down. Don't let me push it down. And for the sake of the camera, let's do this one too. <laughs> hold that one right there, don't let me push it down. You can see she's working pretty hard on that, okay? Now I want you to slide your hips forward for me like you were. And now she's all slumped forward. She's got the forward head, and she's reaching with her arm. Okay, now let's see how strong you are. You got about 25% of the strength. So if you're sitting on the computer for an hour, it's equivalent to four hours of work. So in order to increase the efficiency of the work and decrease the stress on your neck, shoulders, and back, I want you to sit up nice and tall. I want you to slide in just a little bit. Now she's got nice and tall. Even though this is a simple plastic chair, it still has some lumbar, it has some lumbar support. Her elbows are now not reaching and she can reach the keyboard. Now the one challenge with this posture is we always recommend the keyboard to be about eye level at the edge of her personal space. So your personal space is where when someone's in your space, pre-social distancing, you knew they were too close, it's about the edge of your fingertips. So a quick and easy fix, and this is exactly what I use at home, is I took an old, an old inbox that we had sitting around the storage room, and I use that as a monitor riser. And then I have an external keyboard that I can simply plug into, use as the keyboard, use the computer as the monitor, and then I have an old style mouse that I plug in. The wires, wireless ones work just fine. Now she's able to sit up in a good posture, do her schoolwork or her work, minimize the stress on her neck, shoulder, and back. Mm -hmm.